All right, what's up, YouTube? So I'm here in Dilly City, as you can tell. I just woke up with my crazy, messy hair. There's things I have to take care of. I have to be an adult. Life isn't always easy. Not meant to be. I recently found out that my grandma isn't doing well either. My heart is broken right now, you know? So I don't want to leave, man. I really don't want to leave, but we got to. So I'm heading out soon. I'm saying bye to everyone. I'm saying bye to my grandma. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Well, are you leaving now? Yeah. I'll see Be careful, you guys, okay? Um, drive care, uh, drive carefully. So follow me on YouTube. Okay. <laughs> see you guys in a little bit. Let's start driving and visiting my dad. Man, I do this way too much, huh? Alright, no more of that. I'm here at a restaurant that I've been at in a very long time. When I grew up here, like 10, 12, 13 years ago, this is a restaurant I used to visit with my dad all the time. The name of it, you probably can't see it, it's called Superstar. We used to come here all the time, and so I figured I'd come back here for memories. So what I got right here is a bonos with fried rice, tomato. They gave me a tie of fish, man, for four bucks. Extra fish was about another two dollars. Now I've got to go up there. It looks a lot, st it doesn't look as steep on here, but Look at this, man. This is crazy. Woo! Just so you guys can have an idea how I how I really am, check it out. Look back here. Look how high I am, guys. Two-way street. Two-way street. Oh my gosh. Crazy, dude. More hills. I finally found a Starbucks to upload my video. All right, YouTube, so I went to visit my dad. Um, you know, it looks like things are getting worse and I was honestly contemplating on whether I should stay here in the Bay Area to be with my dad while we're still trying to see how bad or how good the situation is. So I need to go back home. There are some things that I really need to focus on so I'll make sure that I go back home when if needed, I'll make sure that I'll come back at a moment's notice to be with my dad again. I'm gonna head out, time to drive back home get away from all this fogginess and barrier and I'll see you guys when I get there. Peace. I wanna go out and face the cold but it's a really good time for a monologue. Can't let this pass, I find it hard to breathe. The time is up, the bell has rang and it's really hard to understand. But losing you now is the only choice for me But someday I wrote some cross before And someday Our ocean will find its shore If you've never been this tired Then you've never been this in love When you feel there is Alright YouTube, so I'm here at the gas station right now putting gas in my car. I'm about three hours away. I'm almost home, but I'm falling asleep. So do you know what I need to buy at the gas station? Hmm. Alright guys, so um, I just put in gas in my car three hours away from LA. So I'll see you guys when I get there. Peace. Alright, what's up YouTube? I'm back in LA, back at work. I didn't really vlog last night when I got home. I didn't get home until like 11.30 p.m. Knocked out, done. So I'm here at work, I'll see you guys at my lunch break. Good to be back. All right guys, I'm here at lunch. First meal after work back in LA. What am I gonna get? What is up, YouTube? Wow, it is dark. Oh, because I'm not in auto. In auto. All right, what's up, YouTube? Uh, so, I'm here. I'm actually here. Sammy's cameras. There's a lens that I ha I've had my eye on for a while that I really want to check out. And I really, really want it. So, let's take a look at it. I don't know if I'm going to get it, but why not look, right? 
All right, let's go. So, I just got back from Sammy's cameras. I'm um, here in Santa Ana. I'm gonna be here the whole day, so I figured I might as well be here and just check it out in the first place. Um, so, I got my new lens. This is a lens that I've been looking at for the last couple of weeks. And I've been like contemplating, should I, should I get it or not? I spent so much money on all this equipment already. What I purchased, I got a Sigma 18 to 35 millimeter with a 1.8 f-stop, okay? It comes with an actual case for the lens. Look at that, man. That is, oh. so this is the Sigma. There we go. Boom. Dang, check this out. This is the lens, it's really long. Okay, this is the wide angle lens, okay? This is the <laughs> actual lens. So I'll be using social lens right now. All right, I haven't even seen it yet. I'm removing the cap. Wow. Oh my gosh. Wow, this is nice. I mean, it's heavier. Like, it's like for a fact, this lens is like a lot heavier. It's really, really heavy. Let me know what you guys think. If you can see the difference, I don't know. When I export this, it'll hide the quality of it. You know, it's. Focus, man, you can see all my acne, look at that. This was a good investment, I'm not gonna lie. What's up, YouTube? I, I'm sorry. I haven't really vlogged much since I got back from San Francisco. Um, I was out of town for a few days, not including driving. In total, was about um, 16 to 20 hours of driving total. Um, and so just coming back and trying to readjust and get back into the habits of my my, um, my daily routines and you know discussing with many different things and you know I guess it's something I do want to talk about and, and it's regards to this channel and uh, you know oftentimes sometimes you know having a channel to be quite honest can be really daunting <laughs> the reason is because to have a YouTube channel do well, you have to consistently post all the time. For me, it's at least three videos a week, minimum. Um, that is the goal. And because I've gotten so busy recently, it's hard to even get three videos a week now. And um, but I put in that time, and you have to stay consistent. And and you know, sometimes you wonder like, why did this video not get this many views? Why did this video get so many views, uh, so many views, and you know, likes and comments? But you didn't even put that much effort to this video. And yeah, these things happen all the time, and it's really like. You could say discouraging and uh, sometimes you know sometimes it'll make me think to be honest like you know I mean is it really worth doing YouTube <laughs> uh, is it even worth pushing through it so much because it get really discouraging um, but you know like I actually put the, posted this on my Twitter the other day I actually posted it today and on my Twitter um, and, and I was thinking about it and I was like, just thinking about it, like should I really quit I mean, I just I just invested in a drone for a thousand dollars. I just bought this brand new lens for eight hundred or nine hundred bucks with tax and warranty. Um, and I'm going to Korea in a couple weeks, and I have to spend money there. And it's like, you know, YouTube and like, is it really worth it still? Is it really worth pursuing? And you know, like I was really contemplating it. I was talking, you know. I was talking to a friend and I was like, I don't know if I should continue with it. And, and to be honest, I am growing and I am doing better than a lot of channels within this niche. There are people, there are people who have 60,000 subscribers, 100,000 subscribers, a million, like 950,000 subscribers. I either get just as much views per video as they do or just less, just a little bit under them. And yet I have only like not even 10,000 subscribers yet. <laughs> you know, and I was thinking about it, you know, like nothing good comes easy, uh, you know. This is something that you like doing, and to be honest, I like doing YouTube. It's fun. I like creating. I like making videos. I like, I like being creative. I like being 
innovative with the videos I put out and it's really fun and I do it because of that I don't do it for the money I don't do it for anything else but end of the day um, when it comes to even doing YouTube uh, even when it comes to programming is it just for the money or is it something you enjoy doing if it's just for the money you won't be happy but if it's something that you genuinely really do enjoy doing and you do it because you just like doing it because it's fun you're passionate about it at the end of the day what's most important is that you're happy at the end of the day and that's what I feel with this channel you know I do it because I love it and it's fun and I love interacting with everyone you know and I do this at the end of the day because I love what I'm doing it's really fun and I'm actually making a difference I'm actually changing people's lives who never would have thought they could ever make a difference in their life that's why, and like I said earlier in the video, this is why I do Dev's Life, because Dev's Life isn't just a name. It's a brand, but it's also a community. And it also represents who you want to be. Right? This is Dev's Life, where you code your own future, where you finally take your future in your own hands, not just whoever employs you, but you could do something about it. You just have to put in the hard work and the effort to make that change, and it'll get there, and it'll get hard, and it'll be discouraging, and it won't be easy. But at the end of the day, what's most important is that you're actually happy. And that's what I feel with my channel. That's what I feel with YouTube. That's what I feel with everything I do in my life. Despite I'm so busy, uh, it's kind of crazy to be honest, but I love it and I'm happy. And that's what's most important at the end of the day. And so I know for everyone else who's coding, who's putting all this effort, like, don't give up, man. It is worth it. It's always going to get discouraging. It's always going to be hard. It's not always going to be easy, but they'll get there will be a point when it's just easy. It's just finally I'm there. But again, like I said on Twitter, how bad do you really want it? When times get really discouraging, when it gets hard, that's when you show how bad you really want it. But all right. I'm end of vlog here. Yeah, I end it right here. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. This is Krishan. This is the Life of a Developer. I hope you guys like my new lens. And I'm out. Peace.